Hey folks, it's Brad here behind the camera. Hey, and we're taking a look at, here's the listing, this green foil fringe curtain, metallic tinsel foil fringe rain curtain, and so on. Um, so it's about three feet wide by eight feet long, which is pretty long. I've got a five foot backdrop there that we just raised up. Uh, that's what I've been shooting on mostly. It doesn't really go with this kind of thing, but that's okay. Um, all right, so, this is sort of a kind of one-time use. You gotta be very careful with it. It's not really high quality stuff, it's cheap. Um, if you expect that, then that's great if you know what you're working with. Okay, so it's just fine for a party decoration. Um, you know, we might put this up at a convention for some little photo thing for people to have fun on their own. Um, so these streamers, if you, if you don't have a, a 10 foot or 8 foot um, backdrop stand or someplace up high to put them then it might not look great at the bottom but something to keep in mind is that if you need to you can cut these things um, so this foil stuff is pretty easy to cut but can make a mess and speaking of making a mess I will show you that one of these came like ripped off already um, so oh well I mean that's not going to be all that noticeable um, and also one of them when we put it up we couldn't tell whether this was before or after there was a rip up there toward the top above the fringe so it's a good idea to um, have some gaff tape gaffer tape on hand um, this one's a good brand the gaffer power as uh, I got it on Amazon I get the black and the white so that's good to be ready for this stuff um, it does have a sticky tapey thing on the back if you peel it off. We didn't do that. We just used some clamps and I put up this ugly side to show you that you do have options but this maybe isn't the best one. If you're thinking it's going to be like a curtain that you can slide over, it's not. So I bunched it up to see what would happen and well okay there it is fine it's okay but looks pretty bad at the top. So. Um, you can either, if you want it to be smaller than that whole three foot width, if you like want it for a background but don't want it to take up the whole thing, you can either tie it back um, like a curtain uh, but keep it straight across the top, or you can fold it in half, double it up or something, uh, or you can cut it and if, if you don't need to keep it in shape, you cut it and then you have whatever width you want. Okay, so this is good okay. Uh, I mean, it's good overall. Um, if you look at the sparklies, you can see that there is what my spouse called a green rainbow. I see yellow to teal for these when it sparkles. So you may see yellow bits, emerald green bits, some darker green bits, and some teal bits in there. Okay, and isn't that fun? All right, so hopefully this tells you everything you need to know. Um, these are, it looks like quarter inch strips, if that helps. Um, and yeah, just be careful with it because uh, it's it's like d intended for a one-time use. But you can use it more if you're careful. All right, take care folks, hope it helped. Oh, wait, one more. Sorry, brain isn't working well. They came on, um, each one came on this set of spools in its own bag, cardboard spools. Probably want to save that because packing this away is going to be a nightmare if you don't have something like that to wrap it up on. So their own little bags inside the big bag in with the spool inside it. All right, take care.